Hi everybody. So today we're going to do another unpackaging of something pen related. And it very well could be pens, but from filling it, I'm not sure. So we'll just go ahead and see what is in here. Oh, okay, so this is actually going to be a pen display stand. And I ordered one of these because I wasn't quite sure how it was going to look or if it was going to be nice or if it was going to be really cheesy. So we shall find out. All right. So the one side on this one is finished pretty well, but that one's not finished the best, but, you know, what do you expect for, like, $2? Oh, all right. I know I don't expect a ton for that price, but then sometimes you get stuff and it's a lot nicer than expected, so. All right, so this one can go, in fact, I'm going to take this off the tripod so you can see it at a different angle, so. This one, I believe, can go either this way or can go that way. So, since I have a pen case here next to me, let's go ahead and put some pens in it. If I can get them out of the case single-handedly. Alright, so there we've got a Winsung 3008, which is a piston filler pen, and I absolutely love that pen. It writes fantastic. We've got a Pilot Metropolitan. A Jinhao X750. We'll throw a shark pen on there just for fun. A little Jinhao shark pen. A Parker Vector. And let's toss a meaty one on there, the Jinhao 159. So, so those can be set that direction. I don't know if, I'm guessing they'd probably fall out on this other direction, but, you know, let's see. Okay, so I managed to do that without dropping or banging any of my pins, so... It can really be said either way, so this would actually be fine at work on my desk for some of my pens, and then be able to grab them easily, but I would probably maybe do it that direction just so that I didn't chance bumping it and knocking them over and having them hit the ground, so. Anyway, I got that on eBay. It was like $2 and change. It was under $2.50, so not bad. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.